Hello, this is Zen from YouTube Tech 101, and in this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to work Windows Movie Maker. So, Windows Movie Maker is in every Windows program, just like this one. So, it's just over here. You can, if if you don't know where it is, just search it, guys. It's Windows Movie Maker. So, let's get to movie, Windows Movie Maker. So, so the basic stuff are import you can import from your digital camera you can import videos you can import pictures and you can import audio or music so let's take it from the top import digital uh videos from a camera so if you have a camera hooked to your computer you can just take files from there and import it over here and if you have video clips you can just take them from your computer and put them over here and edit them and pictures pictures you can upload to make slideshows and stuff so for right now i'm just gonna do import pictures i'm gonna take like two pictures two optical illusion pictures so i'm just gonna import them Sorry, my computer's a little slow right now, so. <laughs> okay, here we go. We have our files. So, these are your files. You take the file, click it, click on the file you want, drag it to the timeline. And let's say I want to get this one too. So I drag this one to the timeline and just let it go. And now you have two videos, two pictures, sorry, in the timeline. And now over here is audio or music. If you have audio or music, you can just import it here. So for an example, I'm just going to take this little clip of music uh, and you wait for the thing to load up so yeah you just take the song and then it's just like the same thing guys just take it drop it in it's pretty simple Oh, look it's almost done it's usually not so slow uh, but my computer is just a little messed up so yeah take the auto audio drag it now see your video is up to here and you don't need all that extra audio so just make it easy zoom out and this is where it ends just go to the end and you'll see this red arrow over here like look at my cursor you see this red arrow click it and drag it all the way to the end of your vid video okay and then to make the editing easier just zoom back in okay now let's try the audio and the picture together So I'm just going to play it. Okay, so that was good, but we need to fix a little bit. So let's go on edit now. That's the main part, edit. Now there's like effects. Like 3D ripple, blur, brightness, brightness and zoom in effect so let's i'm not gonna get into these well if you want to put these effects like just take them and drag it on top of the clip okay so if you want to do effects you can do it translations that's a very good thing especially for slideshow so there's like different type of translations like sorry my sorry my bad transitions i always say that <laughs> so Oh look, here's a good one. It's like a page flipping. Or you can have like this. Different picture. I kind of like this one. Let's choose this one. 
and there you have the flip over here so let's play it from here nice huh okay so now you guys know how to do transition now let's go on titles and credits I hope this computer doesn't do not responding cuz it's very slow and it always stops on me so <laughs> okay so there we go and if you want a title for the beginning of the track you just click on the thingy click on title the beginning track and let's just do a little title like a uh, test add title and there you have it test now look you double click it and then change title animation now you can change the way you want your title to come as you can see over here you can do there's like all these different types of way your title can come in just like this one and there's some cool ones just like flying ones oh I think this one's a good one oh no that this one's just oh yeah this one's cool oh type like a typewriter test yeah and then you can change the color and your font that's what I like. Change the font into many different type of fonts. So I'm just gonna change it the font just for now. Yeah, just like a little test. You can change the color. So let's just do red, for example. And then yeah, look, you have red. Oh, you probably guys probably can't see because of this thing in the way. I don't know why it's not going, but uh, it does come. I'm sorry I just don't know how to remove that thing out there I might have to restart the computer well well this is another thing guys look over here the color of the font I mean the color of the background see over here you can change the color so let's just do color black okay and now look at this it's it's red over here and black okay and you can choose the transparency the size the position let me change the position so you guys can probably take a look at this because it's pretty good let's see um text see over here it's kind of low now but now you can see now you can see test Okay, now you add, click add title and your titles over here. Now there's like other type of ones if title before clip selected. So you just click on a clip and do title before clip, the clip that you selected, title on the clip. So you just click the title, click the clip and do title on the clip. And you can do end credits. I'm skipping through because this is getting too long. So yeah, I'm just skipping through. So yeah, end credits. And then when you're all done editing, make sure you look at what your final copy is. So I'm just going to look at what our final copy is. Yeah, my computer is freezing a little, so it's not going to come up so good, but trust me. So over here you get published to you get settings. You wanna publish this to your computer, uh record it on a CD, email it to your friend, or just put it into your digital camera. So you guys can pick. Some people just do import to your computer, click it, and then yeah. No upload to your computer. So over here, I'm just going to do publish movie. I'm going to upload it to my computer. Name it as test on my desktop. Next. Once you click next, you'll get to this page where it says uh, what quality you want. You can compress it to stuff, but I don't want to get into that. You can just, I, 
the stuff the the main thing the, the thing that i prefer guys i prefer is best quality for playback on my computer that's that's the best and if over here you can choose what type of quality you want like win uh, nts ntsc windows media portable device and other stuff like that but i'm just gonna do best quality and then you do publish and then it's gonna publish your video so yes i hope you learned how to do it you little frozen guy hey it doesn't do all the time just kind of mess today so guys comment and so comment rate and